the topic is about explaining how heat transfer and energy transformation make heat engines, like geothermal plants work. Let's begin. A geothermal power plant is just a heat engine harnessing Earth's heat energy coming from decaying natural radioactive substances to produce electricity. Let us look at geothermal plant as a heat engine. Recall that a heat engine is a device that converts heat partly into mechanical energy. A heat engine has a hot reservoir and a cold reservoir. The hot reservoir of the geothermal power plant is the ground. The water here is converted to steam due to the heat coming from the decaying substances. The steam is the working substance. The steam rises through the pipes to rotate the turbine connected to a generator. We can see that the heat of the steam is converted to mechanical energy that is capable of rotating the turbine. As the turbine rotates, the generator produces electricity. From mechanical energy, we now have electrical energy which can be transmitted and distributed to different areas. The steam cools within the cooling system. From steam, it condenses to become water again. The water is brought back to the ground through the pipes. We can see here that the ground serves as the cold reservoir as well. This water in the ground has potential energy which is converted to different forms of energy as the cycle continues. In summary, this diagram shows how heat transfer and energy transformation make heat engine, like a geothermal plant works. This is the end of the presentation. Thank you.